Hello friends, welcome back. This is Manish Pandey. This is session 4 of Excel as a Database Automation video series. In this you will learn how to write select query to Excel as a database in UiPath. So we are going to take one example. Fetch all customers name from customer seat whose city is New York and customer ID is less than 10. So the query will be in the double quotation select in the square bracket customer name from customer and then dollar where customer city equals to New York and customer ID less than 10. So here customer name is a column name so you can see all the yellow color name so this customer name and customer city and customer ID these are the column names these are the field names which is available in the Excel and this is the seat name so in the seat name from the Excel we get the seat name and then along with that name we need to add dollar symbol so by this way we can write a query for Excel let me show you in UiPath studio so we have this Excel data and now we are going to fetch records those customer names where customer city is New York so here we'll take here one activity that is from the database and now we are going to use a run query so run query here is used to fetch the data with the help of select query so here first we need to establish a connection if you have already established a connection in the connect activity so you just need to enter those connection string here enter that connection string here click on this configure connection click on connection wizard select data source as a Microsoft ODBC data source and this is your data provider now click on connection string click on build click on machine data source and now here we already have this Excel files created this is the data source name and this data source we created in our session 3 video now click on select that Excel files now click OK now select that Excel file which you are going to connect that Excel file now click OK now click on test connection so this is test connection succeeded now click OK and select system.data.odbc this is data provider now click OK now here we have successfully connected this UI path with Excel now here we need to write that query so we'll write here in double quotation select we need customer name so here you can see we have this customer name this is the column name so copy this and now as you can see there is a space here between customer and name so for that we have to take this square bracket and then write this and then put it close with the another square bracket now select that fill name from that seat name so here as per the query select column name from table so here the table name is your seat name from that Excel so you can see this customer this is the seat name that we are going to treat as a table so we'll write here again in the square bracket and after writing this seat name we need to enter dollar symbol and then here we have a where clause customer city customer city equals to in the single quote because now we are going to write here string value the text value so in the single quote we need to write New York and customer ID is less than 10 so copy this customer ID so we'll write here and customer ID is less than 10 now click OK now we are ready to run that but let me take here just to show that let me take here one output data table which will take data from data table let me first store that here we'll write here control K DT underscore customer data copy this now we'll write here and now we are going to convert this data from data table to a string so control K str 
customer data now just to show this one we have to take one message box and write here string customer data now close this and run this now you can see here we have this data customer name john walker nancy and amanda so we have four customers available where the customer id is less than 10 and customer city is new york let me show you here let me open this excel file and let me see so we have less than 10 it means from here we are filtering so let me filter this let me select new york and now less than 10 so we have only four records which is less than 10 id john walker nancy and amanda by this way you can write select query to excel in ui path if you want to learn blue prism please visit my youtube channel youtube.com slash blue prism rpa and also if you want to learn blue prism from udemy and you want to get certificate you can search for my blue prism course th there that is blue prism rpa complete course i will also put the link in in my video description you can go through that there thank you